Thursday, February 27th, and the warming trend has begun. May not have noticed it yesterday, though. Another day with below normal temperatures. 20 of the 26 days we've completed this month have been below normal with at least the high temperature. Uh, right now, we are certainly ranked in the top 15 in terms of the coldest Februarys on record. Records go back about 150 years. So today, about 10 degrees warmer than yesterday. Officially yesterday, topped out at 41. Today, we'll be closer to 50. And then tomorrow, we'll add another 5, 10 degrees onto the high temperature. So temperatures closer to 60. And then Saturday will be the culmination of all this, with temperatures reaching into the lower 60s. Some areas down here in southeast Colorado could actually come very close to 70 degrees coming up on Sunday, or excuse me, on Saturday. Sunday won't be bad either, but uh, a little bit cooler, and we'll start seeing clouds increase. A little upper-level weather disturbance moving through far northeast. Colorado this morning. That's going to generate a lot of wind for us throughout the day on the back side of this thing. The system moves away tomorrow. We lessen the wind and we warm up those temperatures. High pressure building in from Arizona. Saturday, by the way, should be the warmest day in about four weeks. You have to go back to that very first weekend in February. Then colder and unsettled again early next week as the trough of low pressure on the west coast moves in our direction. I mentioned the changes Sunday won't happen until very late in the day. Some rain and then possibly mixed with some snow Sunday night into Monday morning. Could be snowing in Denver Monday morning. A few flurries or sprinkles possible Tuesday. A little better chance for light snow Wednesday. Maybe more flurries Thursday. And then it looks like it's going to warm up and dry out again for the end of next week into that first full weekend in March.